these two squares appear to be identical, but can you spot which one looks better? If you chose the one on the left, you're absolutely right. But why, you might ask? They look the same, but the secret lies in the normal maps. And no, this isn't just your usual normals tutorial. Today, we'll guide you through the process of transforming any AI-generated image, or any image at all, into a normal map, enhancing your scenes or games with unique materials. Let's start by creating our own texture with ChatGPT. We'll input our desired elements, wait for the AI to generate our image, and then save it. Next, we'll visit this website, smartpage.net, link in the description. Here, you can upload your image and adjust settings like depth, invert R and G, and add blur to refine your normal map. Once you're satisfied, hit save. Moving on, let's use pine tools to create a grayscale version of our image for the roughness map. Simply upload your base color image and save the grayscale image it produces. Now it's time for Blender. Select the object you want to texture, go to Materials, and click New. Name your material, then switch to the shading layout. Start with the base setup intact, press Shift plus A, and search for an image texture. Connect it to the base color input and click the folder icon to select your base color image. Duplicate this image texture with Shift plus D, load your normal mapped image. Pull out of color and type normal map and select the one that says color. Connect this to the normal input on your principled BSDF node and switch the color space to non-color. For the final step, duplicate your image texture again with Shift plus D, load your grayscale image and link it to a color ramp. Connect this to the roughness input of your principled BSDF node. You can now adjust the black and white handles on the color ramp to modify the surface appearance from wetter to drier effects. And there you have it. You're now equipped to take any image with a texture-like appearance or generate your own and easily create normal maps that add depth and realism to your projects.